The Case Mansion, located in Auburn, New York, is a great tourist destination for anybody interested in the history of sound and movies. The Cases inherited the property in 1916. At that time, Theodore Case's father, Willard Case, inherited the property. But Willard Case already had a home down the street on Genesee Street. So his son, Theodore Case, moved into the house and turned what had been a greenhouse into the Case Research Laboratory. In 1941, he donated the lab and everything in it to the museum to be the stewards of his legacy of inventing talking movies. Ed Case's big idea, his breakthrough, was that he realized to record sound on motion picture film, he had to change sound energy to light energy. So by 1930-31, the entire American movie business was using the Case system, but Case's name was no longer attached to it. It was called the Movie Tone Sound System. Well, this is a Fox case camera. This particular camera was made by the Wall Camera Company of Syracuse to cases specifications, and it was a Fox case movie tone news camera. The cases in the Willards, who were interrelated, were a very, very wealthy family here in Auburn. He was what you might call a gentleman scientist, and yet in his backyard laboratory, here in Auburn, New York, he made an invention that changed the world. The Willards and the Cases were extremely philanthropic. He was running a cutting edge research lab in his backyard laboratory. The Case Research Lab is open 11 months of the year, six days a week. We're open Tuesday through Sunday, noon to five and people can come and see for themselves where this world-changing invention came from. Talking movies were born here. 